Look straight ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the fear in your eyes. I don't want to lose an eye today. Welcome back everybody. I'm losing my voice, but we're gonna do a really fun video where I don't really have to talk much. Nikki is here. You all know her. She is my makeup artist. She is my friend. She makes my face look really good for these videos. Oh. We have my base makeup on and she's gonna do the rest of my makeup using only her. This is my left hand. Left hand. I can't do anything with my left hand. I can't write. I can't open a package. I can't do my own makeup with my left hand, that's for sure. And I have not practiced, so like we just came up with this idea. Yeah. So I haven't had time to like, you know, practice my left hand skills. So this is like the first time. She's such yeah. a good makeup artist with her right hand. Let's see if the left mm. hand makes a big difference. So to start, just so this video is not like, you know, 10 years long, Susan has her base on. It's our go-to Armani foundation, her brows are on, and then a little bit of concealer under her brows, which is like normally how I prep her eyes. So just, you know, cut me some slack. I need to get that done. And so now we're gonna do with like the fun stuff, right? Okay. So like the blushes, the bronzers, eyeshadow. So. Okay, what are we starting with? I'm gonna start with bronzer. Oh, is this the makeup by Mario? Yes. Wait, what shade is this? Medium dark. I'm gonna use this to warm up your skin just like how we normally do. Can I grab products with my right hand? No. Oh God. Everything's left-handed. It's as okay. if you're a left-handed person. I have to hold some things with my right hand though. Do you use your left hand in real life like to do anything? Yeah, like so normally, like this is normal, right? So I'd be holding this product, right? And then I'd be dipping my brush with my right hand into the product. Oh yeah. And then applying, yeah. Yes. So then I'm gonna- You, you haven't lost I'm your- I'm not cheating. You haven't lost your right hand. Okay, good. You're just you <laughs> using your left hand as the dominant hand today. All right, so let's try this out. <laughs> I feel like I'm working in, oh my God, this is gonna be- Should I switch sides? Well, that's what I thought. Originally, but then I thought people would assume that I was using my right hand if I was swapped. Okay. Oh boy. This feels like I'm doing your makeup. It feels like I'm, it's like I was doing your makeup. <laughs> I think you should put your right hand behind your back when you're not using it. Why, because it's getting too close? Yeah. I feel like it's like helping yeah. me just having it close yeah. by. It's like helping me mentally. This is the longest it's ever taken you to contour my forehead. Oh yeah. My left arm is actually already sore. Oh, because it's not it used to It just goes to show you I don't ever use it. It definitely doesn't have the same Nikki touch. I'm trying to keep my hand down so I don't accidentally cheat. All right. Okay, this is... Oh, oh yeah. we're doing my nose? Yeah. You know, I... Oh, even my eyes? Yeah. I feel like you judge me when I do this. Oh, no, this is my favorite Susan Yura move. The cream bronzer on the eyelid using a massive brush. <laughs> This is what you do. When I'm not around, you use a huge, huge Always. powder brush to apply eyeshadow. Yeah. And I'm like, you're just, you just covered your brows, your lashes, and your eyelid at the same time. It's efficient. All right, you're warmed up, I think. My arm actually, stretch it out, actually hurts. It's gonna be numb after this. Like, bring it back. Thank you. All right, there you go. I gotta put my helmet. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh yeah. Did it crack? Oh, no, okay. it's okay. Let's <laughs> do some eye makeup. Oh, we're gonna. Wow, so, right. already? Okay, you're so. feeling brave. I am. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm not gonna directly apply this. This is an eyeshadow base. I use this all the time from NARS. Okay, so this is how I, I would typically, or one of, the re, one of the ways I would typically prep your eyelids. Oh man, this is rough. This doesn't feel right. This does not to me either. I don't know how to apply the right amount of pressure with my left hand. That's, so I can feel that. And I'm feeling the product skipping on your skin, which I, is not what you want. Like you want makeup to glide onto your skin. You don't want it to skip or like end up tugging. And since I don't have the pressure down with my left hand, this is gonna be a really rough tutorial. <laughs> I'm holding this brush between the two fingers that you should actually hold brushes with. Normally I hold brushes like this between these two fingers. You do? I hold everything between these two fingers. It's like the number one thing that people comment everywhere. Like. They're asking me like, why do I do this? And then wait, show me really quick how this you is do how that. I hold stuff. So like that, that's how I hold everything. Oh, you're right. I've but seen you do that. I can't do it for some reason. With oh, maybe I should try. It just feels so strange. Oh man, I'm gonna try to blow it out like I normally do. Kind of blend it out towards your temple. So this is the Biba palette from Natasha Denona. Incredibly expensive. 
Why? Or, <laughs> Why is this so, ex what's expensive? It's $103. Why? I don't know. There's some pretty colors in there. Oh yeah, there's some really pretty colors. Oh, this prairie color. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna use freckle. Freckle's nice too, but I like You know, it would help if you held some stuff for me. Oh, okay. Right, it would probably help if I stood up straight too. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like I'm working in slow motion. Maybe you're thinking too hard about it. I'm trying not to. I'm trying to just go with the flow like I was just, just you know, typically would. All right, so we're just gonna do a little windshield wiper motion in the crease That's, as we usually do. That doesn't feel like a windshield wiper. That felt like a tug, a tug. Yeah. I'm realizing my left hand shakes a lot. Does it? Yeah. It's unstable? It's un It's unstable. It doesn't know why I'm putting it to all this hard work. And we just got started. I know. So moving on to our second color, we're gonna use a little bit of buff. Mm-hmm. It's not bad. That's, that's actually not bad. Mm -hmm. I mean, we might be here till midnight, but. <laughs> this looks like you're really stretching yourself. Oh, just because my arm is like in the most ridiculous position ever. <laughs> you're so pretty. Thank you. You go with the left hand? Yeah. Super pretty. Oh, that is pretty. Yeah. Honestly, it's pretty. You thought we'd have to wash off this whole I day like... of makeup. <laughs> you were like, well, I'm gonna have to wash my face after. I said, mm mm. Let's do some liner. Oh, are we done with that? Can I just keep this open? Yeah, if you want, you want to. I want to just monitor the damage. For eyeliner, I'm gonna use the Make Continuum Waterproof Gel Eyeliner in the shade Nebula. I love this. Uh, make sure that moves but. to uh, left hand, uh, left oh, hand. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Right, so yeah, I would hold it like that. Okay. It's a twisty? It's twisty. All oh. right. So, look straight ahead. <laughs> I saw the fear in your eyes. <laughs> I don't want to oh lose an god. eye today. I lost my oh. voice already. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, you need to watch those sudden movements. <laughs> oh, see? <laughs> that was not fair. I didn't do that. That, that was, was not you. fair. You did that. I did not do that. I did that. not do you that. Did, you went. <laughs> I did not do that. <laughs> you like head me. We have this on camera. I did not do that. Oh, you'll, <laughs> you'll actually see you went. So traumatic. <laughs> so traumatic. Okay, so now I'm going to blend it out as I usually would. This liner dries down fast, so. You have to work fast. Uh huh. I like a dryer. A dryer. A you liner. Like a dryer. A dryer liner. <laughs> a dryer liner. I like a liner that dries down fast. Oh. Oh. Okay, this is where we need to be careful now. Because we, we have plenty of videos to film the rest of the day and we can't have you go blind. All right. So if you could hold up our palette, please. Thank you. So <laughs> let's set it with a little bit of... Which one? Let's set it with cocoa. Cocoa, that's pretty. Let's make it like a pretty like, You're making me want to spend $120 on this palette. No, like 130 Oh, 130 mm -hmm. Correction. You know, I only bought it because I was influenced by another makeup artist who was talking about how you needed it. It's pretty. It's really pretty. You know what? This liner is looking pretty good. Let me see. Let me see. <laughs> That's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm impressed. Switch back over to the eyeliner on this side. We're going to clean Honestly, it up in a second. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Not bad. No, oh, so I just know how I'm going to get to this side. Okay, that, that works. Oh my God. <laughs> you know, my hand has, it, my left hand is shaking reminds, so bad. It makes me feel like, like the way you're holding your left hand like is like T-Rex. Yeah. yeah, you've got like a T-Rex thing going. Like you're kind of like, I'm stuck here. Oh my God. Okay, breathe. All right. <laughs> you know, I think the biggest thing is if I was, if I was forced to do this with my left hand, like God forbid, I would just have to allot like two more hours to do someone's makeup yeah. to get it done. I'm gonna clean up this liner like I normally would. This is gonna be a little difficult. A little concealer? I have a teeny bit of concealer. All right. I put way too much concealer on this brush because I couldn't tell. <laughs> All right, let's do this guy. I think I should have had any coffee today. 
You're shaking. Let's do something fun. Let's do a little bit of liquid eyeshadow. Just a little bit. So I'm gonna use the Honest Beauty. It's the Payday Eye Catcher Lid Tint. Mm -hmm. Pretty. Let's try to just angle. Oh, it's too much. <laughs> Have you ever tried doing your, your makeup? with your left hand? No. Like for any reason, like for fun? N no. Okay. <laughs> me either. I feel like you're getting more comfortable with it. Yeah. It's just the shake that's throwing me off. Yeah. Cause that hand's like not used to being like- My, This hand is not used to doing anything, but driving. <laughs> yeah. That's it. I'm gonna use a little bit of mascara now. This is the Mascara Lash Rocket from Freck. Oh. With a disposable spoolie. Let's see how we do this. This is probably the most scary part. Yeah. I'd say of the yeah. makeup tutorial. Yeah. Is me. Honestly, you're doing a better job than I thought. Good. You just kind of went in. Yeah. Trying to second guess it too much. All right, this is where it's gonna be a little, let's pull a little crazy move. So this is like Kendall. Jenner. Oh my God, with Try the cucumber. Try to chop cucumbers when you go over Oh like that. my God. This right hand doesn't know what to do. It's like, I'm like over here like clenching my right hand. Her I hand's like going like. I hold my hand. <laughs> that actually, I don't, I don't know if it's distracting or gives it something comforting. Remember okay. I held your hand? Oh, you had like the most firm grip. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's looking good. Let's do some lashes. <gasps> Okay. I've been wanting to put these on you for like, well, since I got them. I recently discovered these. They were the Ardell Professional 3D Faux Mint, Faux Mink. Faux Mink. 3D Faux Mink Individuals. So they have like a little, like, they're like fluttery. What? Really oh. Pretty. So I'm gonna use a little bit of um, uh -huh. the, the Duo Brush On Lash Adhesive. I love this one. So let's see how I would do this. I'd have to hold it like this. Cause this is how I would normally do it with my opposite. So, and obviously I would normally apply lashes with my right hand. I usually use tweezers because my nails are a little bit longer. And so I just take a little bit, dip it into the wand. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, one on. Oh wow, I got some real shakes going on right now. Perfect. Yeah. All right. Those are landing in a nice spot. Are they fluttery? They're they're flirty and fluttery. They're they're perfect for every occasion. Okay. So your lashes are done. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. I was and looking it, in the mirror and I honestly bad. like there was only one little eyelash right here. Yeah, I know. Yeah. You see it? Mm -hmm. That's gonna drive me insane. But we're gonna like not bad though. We're gonna move on so we don't. <laughs> We're just gonna move. We're just on. gonna move on from that because you know, no one's perfect. So that's <laughs> all I have to say is nobody's perfect. I'm gonna use one of our favorites. It's Lenar's Radiant Cream <laughs> Concealer. <laughs> nobody's hey, honey. Perfect. You really like that. Okay, ready? You used her right hand. Mm. That, that was that was behind the scenes. Oh. <laughs> that was behind the scenes. <laughs> that's the goat. Uh huh. <laughs> wow. You really can't blend. Okay, now I'm gonna switch to a slightly. Lighter concealer. This is the NARS, also NARS, the Radiant Creamy Concealer in Creme Brulee. So this is a little bit lighter. I'm gonna use this to highlight, which I love doing, especially, well, on all my clients, but I love doing it on Susan. So we're gonna take a little pencil brush. Boop. So I'm just gonna highlight the tear duct a little bit. Just kind of bring some more brightness in that spot. I'm gonna go between her brows. We're just going for like a nice little natural highlight, nothing crazy. All right, so we're gonna let this concealer dry down a little bit. Let's move on to some blush. Okay. So honestly, I think that you're doing a good job. This is not as hilarious. As I know, as it's kind of sad. I feel like we should have gone, should we like, talk about the other idea? The other idea was we were gonna have, it, have her do it blindfolded, but I was really scared for my eyes. Okay, so this is gonna suck a little bit. I'm gonna use the Nude Sticks Nudies Matte in Sherry. 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 <laughs> so I'm gonna dip into it, but I'm also gonna warm it up on the top of my hand. This feels really strange. I just feel like I have no depth perception with my left hand. Yeah. Like I'm like, 
digging yeah. into my products. There's no muscle memory. No, exactly. All right, we're just gonna tap it on like we normally would. Honestly, that application right there was like pretty normal. Yeah, it's not bad. Except I'm holding it like very, like normally I hold brushes like this. I find myself holding things like this. We're gonna go a little across the nose or some like healthy wash of color. I just totally moved that lash while I, I did that. that. Okay. All right. Okay. So we're, you know, we're almost done. All right. My arm is actually gonna fall off. <laughs> we're gonna go with the little okay. studio mix powder from MAC. This is a powder foundation. I like to use a little hint of this under the eye. We're gonna use NW20. NW20. And before we do so, we're gonna make sure that you don't have any creases, cause I do. Because you have a million creases under your eye right now from laughing. <laughs> so let's take, let's I go try not to. I try not to lift my cheekbones. Let's go back in with our concealer brush. I'm just gonna. I'm actually trying to teach myself not to. Yeah, not be so to, like animated. Well, kind of like posh, right? Like Pasha Spice. Yeah, isn't she famous for not? Victoria Beckham. For not really. Um, Making expression. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so when I'm smiling, I try to smile. Well, I'm not gonna show you until you set my Good, under that's eyes. great. So just a little bit of this powder. I'm just gonna kind of work it into your under eye. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> I'm sorry. You suck for doing that because you were you were so perfect. I know, I'm sorry. Now one lash is like, all of a sudden like this. <laughs> I'm trying not to. I'm trying not to smile with my cheeks. Now we're gonna switch powders. Great. I'm gonna go with the Givenchy Prisme Libre powder in number three. This is like the rose toned powder. So I'm gonna just scoop a little bit out of this and pop it into a little dish. I'm gonna apply it like that. So normally I take a little bit of powder in the palm of my clean hand and I work into my powder puff. Remember when you do this to me? Yep. Yeah. I, I took it all off. <laughs> you took it all off. Every last bit of it. We're gonna get the tease on. Let's go pop that right there. I'm just gonna switch, the, tenor. switch the angle of that cucumber cutting. <laughs> so, <laughs> so now let's set your cream bronzer with a little powder bronzer. This is a Girlactic matte bronzer in Cabo. So tap a little bit in there, tap it off. Just kind of swoop it under your cheekbone, get a little under your jaw. And then you know what? Let's use this for under the eye too. Ooh. Get a little smoky action going on the bottom. Okay, so now I'm gonna get a little adventurous and her makeup's already set. <laughs> what? I want a little bit more of a challenge. I'm gonna go in with a liquid highlighter. This is from Girlactic. It's the Glow Prep in That Glow. So it's, a, it's obviously it's a liquid highlighter. Pop that on your cheekbone. Oh, in the middle of my forehead. Mm -hmm. Well, it's on like the highest point. It's like on your bone, like the forehead bone. I always say like to put it straight across like the highest point. It's just really natural. Like it's like a good like prep before foundation or you can put it on top or you can use it the way I'm using it. Just bring in some glow back in since we already powdered that area. It can be really tricky to layer liquids on top of powdered skin. Yeah. So you have to be very careful when you're doing that. It's not for like the faint of heart. So if you're not skilled, I wouldn't try it. <laughs> or at least don't come at me and get mad at me for saying like, that's not the order that you should do it. I know. I'm gonna go back to our dark brown liner and I'm going to tight line Susan's lash line. That's what I always do. It helps to like blend your mascara with your fake lashes or whatever your, whatever the case is. And you just, you kind of need it. So this is what I would normally do. Normally I would like kind of place my left hand on her eyelid and then go in with my right hand and just very gently line the top lash line. So we're gonna do the opposite. <laughs> this is a no laugh zone. All right. Honestly, not bad. One done. Okay. One more to go. Everything is so much more challenging on this side because I just feel like I can't get to you. But you know what? Slow and steady wins the race with this liner. I've never lined anyone's eyes so slow in my life. Round two, tight lining. We're gonna do the bottom lash line. I'm gonna switch to a different uh, pencil. This is also from Make. It's their Continuum Waterproof Gel Eyeliner, but this is in the shade Otherworld. 
Oh, and it's just like so a really pretty. pretty. It looks like gold. Yeah, it's like a soft bronzy color. Yeah. Uh, yep. And look up. With your eyes. Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh! I All I see is the light. <laughs> You're, you look so fearful. <laughs> We're almost there. Look up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't think I can do it, actually. Should I duck down? Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Did I even get anything on there? I don't know, but all I felt was like my lap, my like- It's my, worth it, it's gonna my, be worth it. My eye was just moving. This is so pretty, it's gonna be worth it. Breathe. I'm barely getting on your waterline. Okay. But I'm really kind of like buffing it into your lash line. I think it's so pretty if you uh, like it's pretty. buff this into your lash line on the bottom. Okay, one more. We got this. Okay. 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 I can feel like sweat dripping down my back now. Whew. Let's move on to some lip. This is the Makeup Forever Wherever Walnut Lip Pencil. I love this pencil so much. This is gonna actually probably suck a little bit. <laughs> okay, I think I met my match. Like this is definitely the hardest thing I've done so far. I can feel the uncertainty. Oh my God. This feels like I'm in makeup school trying to line someone's lips for the first time. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> <My lip. laughs> so I went a little too high on that side, it's okay. It's okay. Just, okay, just go with it. Wow, this is not... I didn't think lining someone's lips with my left hand would be this hard. This is like strangely hard. Like what am I doing wrong that's not... What's my angle? Like how did I get your wing liner on but I can't do your liner, your lip liner? Oh, oh shit. Mm -hmm. Let's clean this guy up a little bit. Let's clean up this little jagged edge. Hmm. Why does this look weird still? Okay, let's do some lipstick. I picked this color out with you in mind. It's Power Mauve from Clé de Peau. But you've put this on me before. Oh yeah, I did, yeah. yeah. It's, it's been on reserve for you in my kit. <laughs> Literally, it's so good. So I have a lip brush. I'm going to try not to break this in half. With your left hand? With my left hand. Because of the pressure. Because of the stupid pressure. <laughs> Ooh, this is such a Susan color, it's not even funny. Okay, <laughs> lipstick is on. We're gonna do a, uh, like one more thing. Just one more thing, so bear with me. Where's our Biba palette? So going back to the Lash Rocket Mascara, I'm gonna use a small fan brush. This is a MAC 205 brush. I love these for applying mascara, especially um, on the bottom lash line, I should say. Okay, so here comes one more. Th this is probably the last scary step, honestly, in this whole process. Fixing that mistake there, huh? Trying to. It's gonna haunt me in my sleep. I can wear my makeup like this the rest of the day. <laughs> I wore your makeup that whole day, <laughs> that whole day. You made me I, look at my work. I made you look at that work and I, I didn't even like touch myself up at all. Did I you know, notice that? Yeah. Not once. Honestly, I, you did a better job than I would have done on myself. <laughs> <laughs> this is weird, shaky things with my left hand. That's bizarre. Okay, so we're gonna set your makeup with the Rare Beauty, always an optimist. And you're done. I like it. Not bad. Give me some. I'm I impressed. Impressed too. I, I think like you it. did a good job. Yeah. I, you did a better job than I would have done. I mean, you still look like yourself. Like it with, was just, with using my right yeah. hand. It was just a really, let me see in the mirror. Okay. I mean, that <laughs> eyeliner is not look, quite up to par. I like how you're like, let me just get let in here. <laughs> I think it's pretty. I like it. It's I think really it looks pretty. really pretty. Yeah. What do you guys think? Does she get a thumbs up? I think she gets a thumbs up. Phew. That Two was that up. was a lot easier than I thought. I mean, oh. no, no, I, I I should take that back. There were some parts that were in. in it only took you hard, how long? Let's see what the time is. Oh, it only took you two hours. It did not. 
It did not. It was like less than an hour and a half. Okay, less than an hour and a half. Way less than an hour and a half. It was, it was less than an hour and a half. For sure, for sure. Okay. For sure, normally our tutorials take like two hours to film. That's true, that's like, true. And I'm using my right Honestly, hand. Honestly, I'm impressed. Yeah. I'm impressed. What do you guys think? Tell us what you want to see us do next as far as makeup tutorials go. Yeah, or challenges. Any challenges. I feel like I learned a lot from this kind of challenge just because like you had to kind of, I heard you walk me through a few things mm -hmm. too, which I thought was interesting. I also think I'm gonna go buy this, even though it's $130. It's so pretty. But those, I know. Those colors. I use this like almost every day. They are so pretty. Almost every day. I like the way it looks on my eyes yeah, too. I, really I want to see what Prairie looks like at some point too. Oh, it's it's really pretty. Oh, really well. pretty. Where can everybody find you? I'm on YouTube and Instagram. I'm Makeup by Nikki LaRose on all accounts, even on TikTok, so you can find me there. But I want to do another challenge like this. I think we should do the blindfold challenge. I think you that'd think be so? fun. Yeah. What do you guys think? I'm down for it. I, I think I could do it. I really do. I feel like I'd be touching your face the whole time to feel your features, but I think it'd be fun. Okay. Sounds good. Well, maybe, maybe. Let's see what everybody else says. Okay. You can find me on Instagram. I'm at Susan Yara, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.